Hello everyone. Today when India is trying to gain the title of Atma Nirbhar Bharat, there are many places in India where we can use the system of radar to make advancements in technology, military, medical sciences and many others. So today I am Purva, I am Hitan and I am Ritri. And we have made a project on radar system, making it functional, cost efficient and inexpensive to be used in different sectors without any problems. So, uh, I'll firstly explain you and give a summary of the project using this flowchart. This is a functional flow diagram. Once the system is started, the Arduino's Python programming is installed, and then the ultrasonic sensor is set up to the initial position where it starts waves and the time that is taken between the sending of the signal and receiving of the signal is very accurately with plus or minus 3 uh, mistakes is detected and with the uh, help of the uh, given formula that is shown earlier, it detects the uh, object and distance accurately. After that, these are the following connections that are made between the Arduino, the ultrasonic sensor and the servo motor. Using these following uh, connections uh, and the help of our uh, software programming with Python and C++, radar system becomes a very efficient model for the topic of Vixit Bharat. These are uh, some efficient purposes in Vixit Bharat that we can use a radar system for and different areas of uh, Bharat today, this can be used to make Bharat uh, achieve its goal of Atma Nebhar. I would now show you the board uh, of Python and programming and uh, the actual visualization diagram where it uh, stores the real time object detection. This is the practical model of the flowchart, the functional diagram and the C++ and Python programming that I showed you. This is the Arduino board. It has the following connections that I showed earlier. This is the ultrasonic sensor and the servo motor. A very simple model, cost efficient and can be used for Dixit Bharat anywhere. Now, I connect this power source to it and as we could see, the uh, ultrasonic sensor swiftly installizes and goes into this uh, position. So now, with the help of the programming in the PC, we are going to start the serial code and we are going to record the data that I have the C programming that is present in the Arduino. With this, the object is uh, object distance and degree is recorded and then it is sent into this python program this python helps us coagulate all of the data and show us into a visual mode here i run this module and i select the respective serial port where our visualization data will come up my hand is the object right now and we can see the real-time object detection on the screen. Here, as we see that Riddhi moves her hand in front of the ultrasonic sensor, degrees 24 degrees, 18.9 degrees and as she increases her distance, the distance on the screen increases respectively. This is how effectively the radar system takes in data and utilizes it to store it into our serial code and is shown in the visualization. We can see multiple data that are taken as Riddhi moves her hand front and back. This is a cost efficient model and it uh, sweeps data of a radius in between 100 centimeters. Advancements can be made in sensors and uh, motors with which we can take an even farther away data with a greater radius and more accuracy. So this was our take on radar system. Radar system is a mother project. Many advancements can be made into it to make it faster, accurate and available to all. It can be used for military purposes, anti-missile projects, in medical sciences for cancer cell detection, in environmental sciences for education of students, making it very feasible, affordable and cheap for use to make and achieve the goal of Vixit Bharat and making Bharat Atmanin.